Hinata Zaka 46 is a Japanese idol group produced by Akimoto Yasushi, who has also produced AKB48 as well as Nogi Zaka 46. Hinata Zaka 46 set records for the best selling single of a debuting female artist. If all of this sounds confusing to you or you want to learn a little bit more about Hinata Zaka 46, well, I'm here to tell you the story of Hinata Zaka 46. <laughs> It all started in 2015 with Keiaki Zaka 46. You might be thinking that's a different name, that's not the Hinata Zaka 46. But this has to do in part with the story because later on in their debuting year, we learn of a member called Nagahama Neru, who joined in after the first generation or generations known as audition groups. Think of generations as a hiring round. With these idol groups, we have a different hiring round and the selected members that get chosen are now known as a generation. Now, this is where the problem with Neru comes in because she was part of the first audition, but she didn't make it to the final auditions. So she was out of the run for the first generation. So when the first generation is already part of Kiyaki Zaka 46, this is where trouble arises where Neru no longer belongs part of the first generation but is now part of the 1.5 generation. Now this caused everyone shock and we learned later that the reason why this happened is because she was in the final auditions for the first generation but then her mom took her out and after some convincing she was put into this 1.5 generation. So on November 30th 2015 we learned Nagahama Neru gets finally inserted into Kiyaki Zaka 46 through their actual TV show, Kyakite Kakenai. Shin member, Nagahama Neru-san desu, dozo! Now, while Neru was allowed to join the group, she wasn't allowed to become a formal member. She was now known as an understudy member. And management, seeing that she was alone, decided, hey, let's add in more people to join her understudy group which is where the whole separation of Senbatsu or the selected members come in versus the under members. Now this isn't too foreign of a concept because their older sister group Nogizaka 46 actually does the same thing except for one difference. With Nogizaka 46 they're alternating members between the Senbatsu again selected members and the under members so people get different chances. Meanwhile in Kiyaki Zaka 46 it's a little bit different because it's a firm group of Senbatsu versus the under members, which is where the name Kanji Kiyakizaka 46 and Hiragana Kiyakizaka 46 comes from. Approximately 12,000 girls actually applied to be part of this new group that would be happening under Kiyakizaka 46. And on May 8th, 2016, only 11 of the girls were chosen to become part of this official group, Hiragana Kiyakizaka 46. Unlike previous Sakamichi series, Nogi Zaka 46 and Kiyaki Zaka 46, which are two sister groups, Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46 wouldn't be treated as a sister group to Nogi Zaka. They'd again be an undergroup of the main Kanji Kiyaki Zaka 46. It's very confusing. We were confused when we first heard about this as well. And after six months, on October 28, 2016, they held their first event called the Hiragana Hospitality Party, where the new girls were able to show off and show exactly what they were made of. Then on May 31st, 2017, they decided to hold auditions for the second generation. Again, generations being different audition groups. So it was a bit weird to have a second generation already after the first generation had barely been there. This hadn't really happened before in the Sakamichi series, whether it's Nogi Zaka or Kiyaki Zaka. And this time over 15,000 people actually went to go apply to become the second generation of Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46. And then on August 13th of that same year, nine new members were added to make the second generation of Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46. Trust me, the name gets easier once we go further down and you'll see why. Then tragedy struck. The girl who started it all on September 24th, 2017 was decided to become fully in part of Kanji Kiyaki Zaka, no longer being part of Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka. And with the concurrency ending, Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46 was left alone, but they decided to continue forward and push on through. Things actually went pretty great for them. In the first half of 2018, they held their own live at Nippon Budokan Arena where many people strive to perform at a super large venue 
and they did it for three days. Not only that, they also got the full length album. They got their own variety TV show where they do fun stuff all the time. They also got their own drama series on Netflix, which you can actually watch right now. And they even got their own stage plays. And I mean, without a captain in all of this, you know, someone to supervise them, they kind of lost. So on June 3rd, 2018, they decided Sasaki Kumi to become the captain of Hiragana Kiyakizaka 46. So with the captain and all their TV shows and all their coverage, people were thinking, okay, so they're pretty much their own group now, but they're still considered unders to Kanji Kiyaki Zaka 46. So people started to think, okay, should they be separated? Are they a different group? And that was between fans. Looking at the general public, they didn't even know Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka existed. They just thought Kiyaki Zaka and only thought Kanji Kiyaki Zaka 46. Really, that's concerning for people who are trying to strive forward and have all this stuff but no recognition for it. So, the independence actually got further speculated when they actually announced something called the Sakamichi Series Wide Auditions which was an audition process for all of the groups under the Sakamichi name, which are Nogi Zaka, Kiyaki Zaka, and Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46, making fans think, okay, they're separating it a little bit more than usual. Then on November 29th, we have the third generation who finally joined as a solo member to Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46. And hey, she even got her own welcoming at Nippon Budokan on December 10th. Then on February 11th, during a special showroom, they laid out the news to not only the fans, but to the members themselves that they will no longer be Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46. They will now be Hinata Zaka 46. Everyone was shocked at this news. Nobody suspected it. We all had our assumptions that they might be better as independents, but we didn't think it would happen so soon. Now, what does this mean for the group? It means that they're now an official sister group to Nogi Zaka 46 and Kiyaki Zaka 46. Their name coming from Hyuga Zaka, which is located in Minato Ward in Tokyo. Very similar to the other groups under the Sakamichi series, kind of like Nogi Zaka, Kiyaki Zaka, and Hinata Zaka, each meaning their own hill. So along with this announcement, they heard that they will get a first single by the name of Kyun, as well as their own website and fan club. The group's color was actually decided to become sky blue because of the motto Sora Made Takaku Toberu Yoni, or the English translation, which is May we soar as high as the sky. And with all of this news, they went ahead and did a debut live under the name of Hinata Zaka 46 with a two-day concert in Yokohama Arena. And during this concert, on the very same day, they went from Hiragana Kiyaki Zaka 46 to the brand new Hinata Zaka 46. And with almost 24,000 people actually going to the Hinata Zaka 46 debut count live, it was a big success. So on March 27, 2019, the debut single, Kyun, actually got 476,000 copies sold in its first week. Now, this set records not only for the daily, but the weekly of the most sold female artists in Japan's history. And so they continue with just a second single announced recently. We move on to Hinata Zaka 46's future where they are now independent and now it is up to them to rely on their own name, no longer on Kiyaki Zaka 46's name, but now under the Sakamichi branch of sister groups. Please leave your comments down below what you thought about Hinata Zaka 46 and what you think about their future and upcoming titles. If you enjoy this video and want to learn more about idols, please go ahead and subscribe to us to learn more about this series as well as other things that we talk about. If you like Hinata Zaka 46 or are more interested in them and their sister groups, go ahead and check out the Slope podcast, which you can go ahead and check out on this channel as well as other podcast platforms. That does it all. I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll see you on the next one.